With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello students, have a look at the question. Question is in the figure of mammalian spermatozoan, identify the different parts marked as A, B, C and D. So here they are given the diagram of the mammalian spermatozoa or we can say that the sperm, spermatozoa, sperm that represent the male gamete. If we will see the uh, different parts of the sperm, mature sperm, it is made up of the different three parts that is the head, head, second part it contains the mid piece that contain the mid piece and third part is that is the tail but in the figure we have to uh, mark the a b c and d part here we can see that the a part that represent the acrosome a that is the acrosomes acrosome these are vesicle differentiate from the golgi operators these acrosomes are very important they help in the penetration of the uh, sperm to the egg in this way they facilitate the fertilization so it is present in the head region so we, we can mark it as a a is the acrosome next b part that is also present in the head region that b part it represent the nucleus it represents the nucleus. Nucleus is the actual DNA of the sperm which combines, which fertilizes with the DNA of the uh, ova to make a diploid zygote. So, this is the B part that is the nucleus. Next is the C part. C part that is present in the mid piece. In the mid piece, the present is there is the mitochondria mitochondria as present mitochondria as we all know it is known as the powerhouse of the cell so as the name indicate powerhouse it provides energy for the swimming of the sperm so here we can see that the, this all the energy for movement of sperm that is being provided by the mitochondria numerous mitochondria they are present in the mid piece of the sperm so c that is the mitochondria and d that D that is present in the tail region that is the axial element, axial also oh, axial filament, axial filament that is formed from the distal centriole and they uh, they they help in the movement of the sweep like movement of the sperm or we can say that the swimming of the sperm. So these are the A B C D part. Here we will see option we are having different option. Here A acrosome, B nucleus. C mitochondrial spiral and D axial filament. Yes, option A that is completely correct. Second, A is the axial filament. This is incorrect because A is agrosome. A nucleus, this is also incorrect. A agrosome nucleus, C axial filament. This is also incorrect. Option A is correct. Hope you get it. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.